like what like what is this <laughs> what is this hey guys welcome back to my channel i hope you guys are all doing well in today's video we are going to do a first impression kind of a review i have newly launched makeup products with me today biotic came up with their new makeup line and we all know that biotic is a skincare brand and i don't like few of their products anyways i was really really excited when i saw nike uploaded a picture that biotic is coming up with their new makeup line i was like i should give this a try and i should let you guys know what i think about this product so i have few of their products with me from their range and i am going to do a first impression because it literally came just now so this is the first time i'm going to try out this product and i'm going to let you guys know i'm going to show you guys how it looks on my skin and everything if you're interested then please keep on watching make sure to subscribe to my channel if you haven't already let's get started okay so before showing you guys what i have from their collection quickly i'm going to talk about their collection and what product they have launched and what their collection claims and everything so they came up with three different collections one is their diva collection one is their star collection and one is their magic collection i think so they claim that this are skin care infused makeup products which i think is really great they are a skin care brand they believe in natural ingredient and they believe in a uh, like harmless ingredient for your skin they brought this makeup line which will not only help you to enhance your skin but also will nourish your skin that means you are getting something which is not full coverage or anything it will be a very natural kind of makeup that you are getting from this brand which is i think great okay so we have four products and this four products are from their magic collection now, on the diva collection i have seen they have lots of varieties like they have foundation shimmer dust they have eye shadows um they have so many products it's a bit expensive for me like they have their uh, star collection also their diva collection star collection is not expensive it's like within 500 rupees i think but the diva collection is like, a little bit expensive and we are not reviewing any of those today okay so from their magic range i have their biotic foundation this is what it looks like i'm going to open the packaging for you guys I have their powder with me. I have a eyeliner and a lipstick with me. By the way, I have already seen the color of this lipstick. So, I am going to show you guys the foundation first. Oh, let me prime my face first. Today I'm using a primer. And this primer is from Inside Cosmetics, a very affordable primer which costs for rupees 250, I think. And I'm just going to use it on my face just like this. Wow. I'm using this primer for a week now. Let me tell you guys, this primer, oh my god, I'm just going to use it on my eyelids as well. This primer is so good. It's like so affordable. I just thought, "Okay, okay, let's try it out." And this primer works really really. Anyways, this video is not about the primer. I am going to show you guys the foundation. So, this is what the foundation uh, looks like. I'm going to show you guys the packaging first. To be very honest, I am really loving the packaging. The packaging is very very cute like this green and this pink detail and with orange flowers in it and this is what the product looks like. As you guys can see is super amazing. I just checked out their website. They only have four shades like what four shade maybe they launched a very very new product i think maybe they are just trying out with the shades but i am a little bit disappointed with the shade range there is like four shades one is honey one is caramel one is vanilla and one is orchid i think caramel and honey can be used if you are a dusky skin tone but i am really not happy with the shade range and i think i have this shade vanilla with me I hope so. Makeup foundation is an all-day foundation. They have claimed that it's for all skin type, and it also contains SPF 15. SPF 15 is a little bit low, but okay, it contains SPF. Here, what the product uh, actually looks like. Here you have the MRP. Here is what the packaging looks like. It's in description. Everything is given, but they haven't mentioned any ingredients. Um, I am just checking this out if they have mentioned any ingredients maybe you can get the ingredients from their website the, this foundation retails for 140 rupees for 30 ml of product i think that's good enough 
and yeah this is what the product claims and you don't have any ingredients mentioned or anything which I think another disappointing part so this is what the shade looks like so I'm trying to uh, blend this out with my fingers so as you can see this will give you a very very light coverage like a very light coverage and I think it will give you a smooth glow as well oh my oh my god this is the problem I always face with biotic product it smells so strong like so strong this foundation is so scented oh my god I don't really like this kind of scented products for my skin anyways I am just gonna use this I am gonna zoom you guys in so that you guys can see what I am doing so I'm just gonna use this like this I'm gonna take little bit not much and this is not my shade obviously this is a little bit light for my skin from Milargo Beauty and I'm trying to blend this foundation oh have you guys seen that like it's all gone okay okay let me blend this side with a brush so that you guys can see the difference Okay, so I have my duo fiber brush with me and I'm gonna blend this out. Hmm, not bad. Actually not bad, like not seeing a huge difference with the shade range because it's a very very light coverage foundation. So I think like oh my god, I am literally hating this scent. This is like... If you're a person who don't really like scented product, you're gonna hate this foundation, I'm telling you. I will definitely recommend you guys to use this with your fingers or with a brush. Because with a beauty sponge, I think you will not get that much coverage. But if you want a very, very light coverage just to even out your skin tone, you can definitely go with a beauty blender. I think it obviously evened out my skin tone. I think it's looking pretty good. You guys can see a glow going on like you guys can see this will give you a glow as well but I don't know if you are a very oily skin person I don't know how it will work on your skin this is a very very lightweight foundation obviously it claims it's a natural makeup foundation so it will definitely give you this kind of natural look I'm just gonna give you guys a close-up how my skin looks right now you guys can see the glow you guys can definitely see my pigmentation and everything but this glow i am to be very honest i am loving this glow like this glow i just i just want this kind of foundation which will give you this kind of healthy glow so i am loving it uh, so far so good so we don't have any concealer from this range so i'm gonna go with my swiss beauty concealer just a little bit because i don't want to uh, cover up my foundation just a little bit over here and that's it I don't want to use concealer all, all around my skin I'm just gonna use a little bit of concealer okay so as I'm looking into the mirror I can see how natural this foundation is like this foundation is definitely a very very natural foundation so the next product that we have is this one this one is their uh, magic compact and this claims this is for skin lightening and whitening i don't know why why you need that in your life and why few product claims skin lightening and whitening and we are not going to talk about all this in today's video packaging the same floral pink orange green packaging that you guys can see and here you have the compact and this is what it looks like a very beautiful pink color like it looks really really classy i think like look at this it looks beautiful and here you have a mirror with you i think that's great the mirror quality is really nice you are obviously having this with the powder and this is what the powder and the packaging looks like so what I'm gonna do I'm gonna take my powder brush I don't really use all this to powder my face so I'm just gonna use my powder brush and I am going to use this powder this powder is really very dusty I don't know why 
but I can feel that the powder is really really very dusty. I'll show you guys the difference. This is the side where I haven't used powder and this is the side where I used the powder. I am impressed. One apply, it sets your makeup. You guys can see the difference. My concealer is all set. I'm gonna use powder right over here as well. Powder is not any kind of mattifying powder or something. Uh, if you want uh, a quick touch up, I think you can definitely go with this powder. I think it's not bad according to the price. The price is really cheap. So I think according to the price, this works really, really well. Same packaging like floral, pink, green packaging. And uh, let me show you guys how the eyeliner looks. And um, this eyeliner costs for rupees 120 for 9 ml of product. And uh, this is how the eyeliner looks. It's a glass packaging. And uh, yeah, this is a black eyeliner. They only have a black eyeliner. And this is what the applicator looks like. I am not a big fan of this kind of applicator but let's see how it works. Let me tell you guys what the eyeliner claims. This is a water resistant eyeliner. So from the Diva range and also from the Star range I think they have their different kind of eyeliner but this is the cheapest one and we are going to do a quick test. So I'm going to just draw a few random lines and then we are going to see. Let this dry and after that we are going to see actually water resistant or not okay guys i freaking hate this eyeliner like look at this eyeliner guys like what is this like this is not even a proper black color like it's it's kind of like it will look so bad it's like i think a 50 30 50 rupees eyeliner and i don't know i am not into this kind of eyeliner let me do a quick I have water right over here. This is water, a spray. So I'm just gonna show you guys how it. Okay. Wow. Like they claim that this is this is a water resistant eyeliner. Like what? Like what? Like what is this? <laughs> what is this? So. Anyways, we have to use this eyeliner because this video is all about it and this was such a bad fail. I know I am not the perfect one. I'm not perfect in doing wing eyeliner. Let me tell you guys, but if you are a if you are that beginner, this eyeliner is definitely not for you. So I'm just going to try out again. Now I am not getting that grip with this kind of uh, eyeliner brush that's the reason why i don't like this kind of brush so i'm just gonna do it again okay, I no not recommended i'm just gonna do the same thing on my other eye what my eyeliner is looking right now and uh, yeah that's what it is okay so the last product that we have i am so excited um, is this lipstick so this is their multi-color lipstick and uh, this is what it looks like same packaging so this is just a normal lipstick and uh, here what the packaging looks like also in pink and this reminds me of Avon pretty pretty Avon something pretty I don't know so what the packaging uh, looks like I'm gonna show you guys the lipstick and here you have the lipstick I have this color bond girl kind of a brown lipstick but I think like it's pretty good you can see like it's not that shiny glossy lipstick it kind of have a shine but not that much like if you are a person if you want a matte lipstick you can easily use a press powder or a tissue to make this matte i think use this lipstick uh,
Now this definitely have a very very creamy formula and the pigmentation is really really good. Don't try to overline your lips without a lip liner. To be very honest, I am loving this lip color. I don't know why I am not a lipstick fan. I'm not a lipstick fan. I'm a liquid lipstick kind of person. I can I think you can easily rock this lipstick and it also contains a smell but not too strong like the foundation. The foundation was oh my god. It's too strong but um, lipstick is quite nice the color payoff the pigmentation everything is super amazing I am very impressed with the lipstick so that completes this video I am going to rate this foundation um, kind of 7 out of 10 because I I'm quite loving this foundation to be very honest if they can remove this lightning whitening thing then I am going to uh, give this powder also a big 7 out of 10 uh, for the eyeliner it's a minus 2 for the lipstick I'm gonna give this lipstick um, kind of 8.5 out of 10 go for it it's very affordable it's like the magic range I'm talking about the magic range it's very affordable and we are all here for affordable makeup so yeah guys that completes this video I hope you guys enjoyed and find this video helpful all the links all the product will mention down in the description box below make sure to check that out thank you so much for watching I love you guys so 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 much please make sure to subscribe if you haven't already and I will see you guys on my next video bye